I know I need to be here. This is good. I have things in my life that I need to get off my chest. God already knows what I did. It's not like he'd be shocked. I can't remember the last time I've done this. I don't even remember what to say. What if the priest remembers me? What if someone I know sees me? They'll know I did something wrong. This seat is really uncomfortable. Is this whole forgiveness thing real? Can I just tell God on my own? If I'm in there too long, people might think I did something really bad or that I have a lot of sins. Come on, man. Just go. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, Amen. Amen. Father, I have to be honest. I have no idea how any of this works. I haven't been to confession since I was ten. I'm a little nervous. Well, first of all, I'm glad that you're here. You made a good decision. That you've come to ask our Lord for forgiveness. That shows a lot of courage. Thank you. Now, before we begin, let me ask you a question. Do you really want to be here? Is this something that you're doing for you, or did someone force you to come today? I made the decision to come. I know that I need to be here. There are things from my past that, that I need forgiveness from. Good. Now there's one thing to remember about the sacrament of confession, that it's Christ himself who's going to forgive your sins. So I'm just the instrument that he uses. I can't forgive sins on my own, but rather Christ uses me as the instrument to forgive your sins. So as we move forward, remember that. You're speaking directly to Christ. Okay. So let's begin again in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. Now you can begin. Uh, what's heavy on your heart? What would you like to bring to our Lord? Well, I feel like a lot of times I'm, I'm too selfish. Is there anything else you'd like to bring to our Lord's mercy? No, uh, just that. Okay. Well, again, it's a great thing that you're here. Uh, for your penance, I would just like you to say one Our Father and one Hail Mary, just as an act of thanks to God for His mercy. Do you think you could do that? Yeah. Okay. And if you could please just make an act of contrition, there should be a sheet for you to read off of. You just read that out loud, and then afterwards, we'll finish with absolution. My God, I am sorry for having offended you. In choosing to do wrong and failing to do good, I have sinned against you whom I should love above all things. I firmly intend with your help to do penance, to sin no more and to avoid whatever leads me to sin. Our Savior, Jesus Christ, suffered and died for us. In his name, my God, have mercy. Amen. Amen. God, the Father of mercy, so the death and resurrection of his Son, has reconciled the world to himself and sent the Holy Spirit among us, for the forgiveness of sins. Through the ministry of the church, may God give you pardon and peace. And I absolve you from your sins, in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. Again, it's a great thing that you came today, and I hope you never forget that your sin, no matter how great or how small, uh, God's mercy is greater. We just have to come and ask Him for it. Thank you, Father. I'll remember that. Okay. God bless you. See you next time. God, thank you for leading me here to confession. Although I don't totally understand it, I know that it is you who forgives. Thank you for your mercy and love. Help me not sin and turn away from you. Our Father, 
who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done 